Hello viewers, 4DIYers here with another video for everyone. In this video here, I'll be reviewing this power station by All Powers. This is their S300 model that is rated at 300 watts. And along with this, I'll be reviewing their 100 watt solar panel, which can be used with this power station. It can do both AC and DC outputs and has a variety of ports for your needs, which I'll cover in a moment. This is a very compact unit, so it makes it extremely portable and has a wide range of applications. Opening the box, first we have a zip-up case that includes a charging cable. Next is the user manual, and finally is the power station. At the top we have a heavy folding handle. On the top is a wireless charging pad for a smartphone. On the front we have two AC ports, two LED lights that can be controlled wirelessly or through the orange buttons, large screen which shows a variety of information, a Bluetooth button, and a DC and AC activation buttons. Pressing any of the buttons will wake up the screen. It'll show the current battery charge. If something is plugged in, it'll show the draw and calculate how much time is left, the input of the charging, if Bluetooth is activated, and if the AC or DC is on. On the next side, we have a cooling vent on the top, one USB-C port, and three USB-A ports. The USB-C port can be used to charge a device or charge the power station. However, the USB-A ports are only used to charge devices. Then there are two other DC output ports. The other side has another cooling vent and a DC input, solar input, and cigarette lighter style 12 volt output. Here's a solar panel. This folds up in a neat package and is quite large when opened up. Opening the pouch, there is wiring to hook up the panel to the power station. Then removing the flap on the other side, it's held together with Velcro. Unfolding the panel, and you can see how large it is. Unfolded, it's 48 inches by 25.6 inches, and folded, it's 20 inches by 25.6 inches. Testing out the power station, here I have my Milwaukee battery charger hooked up to it and it can easily charge the battery. This power station can be controlled wirelessly. I've already went ahead on the App Store and downloaded the app. Just search for All Powers. I have added the device, then clicking on it you can see all the data from the power station instead of viewing it on the screen. It'll have the current percentage, time left on its current load, input and output wattage, the DC and AC can be activated or deactivated here, and I can also control the lights from my phone. With the phone charger on the top, I do find the phone has to be perpendicular to the power station, and the position is slightly off to the right. Testing out the solar panel, plugging it into the appropriate connectors, the connectors have rubber gaskets which makes them water resistant. On their website, you can attach multiple solar panels together, decreasing the charge time for the power station. Today, with it being overcast and no sign of sun, it has an output of 1 watt. The power station uses its tenary lithium battery and has an output waveform of pure sine wave, which is acceptable for a wide range of electronic devices, including those that can be sensitive. It has various circuit protections that include short circuit, overcurrent, overpower, overcharge, and over temperature. There is a built in cooling fan which isn't overly loud. Through my testing, it only turned on for a brief moment. The power station weighs a total of 7.5 pounds and the solar panel comes in at 7.9 pounds. As for the solar panel, it has a polysilicon solar cell, it is waterproof, 22% efficiency, max power of 18 volts and a max current of 5.4 amps. The rear of the solar panel, once it's opened, has built-in stands to help angle the panel. This whole setup is great for any small jobs where you need to power up small lights using low amperage power tools or charging batteries. It can also be used in your vehicle in case of emergency, used for camping, a backup during power outages, etc. Have you purchased this product? Please be sure to share your experiences in the comments below. New videos are released every week on my channel. Be sure to hit that thumbs up button. It's a huge help to me. If you're not a subscriber, be sure to also hit that subscribe button. Thank you for watching.